Harper J. Ransburg was born in Steuben County, Indiana in 1886. By 1911, 1910, he had started a business making cut glass. Did really well and then started branching out into other products, including decorated candles. After that, he moved to stoneware. And from stoneware, he went on to, into metal products, wide variety of metal products. Interesting part about the metal products is they just spray painted all of the, the back uh, ground and then painted over it. Spray painting wastes a lot of paint because not only are you painting the product, but it spreads all over in the painting booth. So uh, one of Harper's son was working on the idea and invented a method of electrostatically attracting paint to a metal object so that when they started painting, rather than the spray going everywhere, the paint was attracted to the can and stayed on the can. Saved a huge amount of uh, paint. But interestingly enough, they patented the process and it was used all during World War II for painting a wide variety of military products and it's used today for painting cars. After tastes changed, uh, they started going into other decorative objects. Uh, plastic became uh, one of their, the things that they did. And in those cases, they were not painting the product, they were actually uh, uh, stenciling it on. They, they produced thousands and thousands of items. They went all over the United States. We even have an article showing Ransburg canisters in the White House kitchen, which I think is really cool. And he was also interesting in his marketing concept. He didn't necessarily just go to the store and uh, put a display up. He went to things like hardware stores and put a display up, figuring that if the guys are going in to buy tools and stuff and the wife comes along, she's going to look at things like this. And it went over well. So that's another way uh, that he was really uh, innovative is in his marketing techniques. When I chose the objects that we put on display, looked for a variety of shapes, objects, everything from trash can to toilet paper holders to Kleenex boxes to canister sets. Tried to pick a variety of colors, tried to pick a variety of patterns, and uh, uh, just to make it so it was kind of a visual delight to, to the objects, and also emphasize how many, how wide the variety of products were uh, that Harper J. Ransburg offered to the people.